today we're cleaning a toaster. Come on in and welcome to my home. Today is such an easy thing to do, but it's something everybody seems to forget to do. That's clean your toaster. Now, some of you probably have toasters which haven't seen cleaning like, say, ever. Mine's been in quite a while. It's such an easy thing to do, but it's really easy to forget. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your toaster is, is unplugged. Make sure it is unplugged. No cleaning this while it's plugged in. Now, most toasters have a little slide tray which catches all the crumbs. I'm going to wash it out and then thoroughly dry this so that, that way it is nice and dry before I even start to go back into this. Sitting that off to the side for the moment. Now I'm going to turn my toaster over and shape. Look at that. That is a mess. Now I've got some brushes in case you're wondering what those were for. And I'm going to go through and brush the top of my toaster the insides. If your brush isn't long enough to get down into those really hard to reach areas, go ahead and use a different brush. This will actually take some time, so go ahead and take your time with this. Once you have your toaster as crumb free as you can get it, I'm going to use vinegar, and this is just straight vinegar, on an old cloth to clean out the outside. Don't worry, the vinegar smell will go away. Don't forget to also clean your cord. Once everything is nice and clean and dry, go ahead and reassemble it. And that's all the mess that was in my toaster. Before you use it, make sure that this is thoroughly, thoroughly dried. You notice how we didn't use any water on it? Yeah. So make sure it com is completely dried before you go ahead and use it and you are all ready. You have a clean toaster. If you do this, let me know. You can get a hold of me on most social media at CM Coleman Home. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. You can share it. Don't forget to subscribe and check out the other videos on this channel. I love making these videos for you and I hope I get to see you again next time.